Now at 4.30, a new view of the moments leading up to a vicious blow that left a man with a fractured skull and permanent damage. A South Beach nightclub paying the price for a bouncer's suspected crime. A tourist's life changed forever, and now a civil case is closed. Seven's Elite Sabizios with the story. He yanks Eunice out of the club forcibly. A surveillance video capturing the moments right before 22-year-old Eunice Adlin went from South Beach tourist to fighting for his life. It was January 1st, around 5 in the morning, when the victim's roommate found the college student lying motionless and beaten. The friends were there from Rhode Island to celebrate the new year. Great suffering. It was eight months. Day by day. The victim's father speaking Wednesday, updating the media on his son's condition. He needs the help 20 hours, 24 hours by day. His mom is still with him. He can't be uh, alone. He needs help. He can't work. The moment you see Eunice walk back into the frame here, then out, is when his attorney says the bouncer hit his client to the ground. The encounter happening outside Cameo Nightclub on Española Way. According to the police report, the victim's skull was fractured. His brain was bleeding. Here's a picture of him when he was in a coma at Jackson Memorial. Now, months later, a payout to the victim, $5 million in damages. A victim's attorneys and his father announcing a $5 million settlement Wednesday between the family and opium group owners of Cameo Nightclub. That failure goes to the club. They did not train this man. This man ran around with impunity and thought it was okay to do what he wanted. Seventies reached out to Opium Group, but they had no comment. The doorman of the club, who's allegedly seen here pooling at Eunice, faces one felony battery charge and is due back in court on September 3rd. On Miami Beach, Elisa Bezios, 7 News.